It's Tuesday, January 15th, and we've got, as you can see, another Hot Wheels video, another Garage Series video. This is a 30-car set. It's the uh, Wayne's Garage, Larry's Garage, and Phil's Garage. This was another one I picked up off of eBay. I got it for $60, which was, I thought, a pretty good deal. Um, so we're going to go ahead and crack it. Here's what, uh, here's what you get. You actually get three carded cars, and then you get the rest. Um, you've got Rolling Thunder which it does list just like the other ones at the top there and on the back. So here they are at the back. Rolling Thunder, Neat Streeter, 57 Chevy, Fished and Chipped, 71 El Camino, Street Rotter, Barry 8, uh, 70 Chevelle SS Wagon, 64 Lincoln Continental, probably one of my favorites. Shoebox, Golden Submarine, 51 LeSabre Concept, Purple Passion Woody, hmm. School Busted, 57 Chrysler 300, 34 Ford Sedan, 71 Mustang Mach 1, the Bone Shaker, the Custom Volkswagen Beetle, Custom 66 GTO Wagon, also pretty sweet. Another passing gasser, just like the uh, last set we got. Um, 68 Barracuda, 70 Chevelle SS, 69 Camaro, 66 Chevy Nova, 69 Charger, 288 GTO, another Ferrari, uh, 51 Pro Mod Willys, a Volkswagen drag bus, awesome, and then the 8 crate. So uh, the, the box is in pretty good shape. What had happened was, make a long story short, got it on eBay, actually actually it was 65, not 60. Uh, $65 um, plus shipping is what it was originally. And the poor guy that, uh, the seller, has really good feedback. He, right before the auction ended, a few hours, he said, hey, don't pay for this, you know, I fell and broke my arm. And I don't have really a way to ship it. Um, he said, I can only ship you know, small items, I only have use of one arm, what have you. Um, so I waited, and then, you know, at first I was kind of skeptical. I'm like, well, maybe he just sold it. And then, uh, you know, he was real apologetic. He said he'd cancel the auction, he'd make it right. And then I simply said, hey, you know, I'm not that concerned about the box, the outside of the box. Um, and he was really close, so he's only stayed away. I said, just uh, tape the edges and slap a label on it, and, uh, you know, I'll go ahead and pay for it, and, uh, you know, all is well. So uh, that's what he did, and it came, came through great. He shipped it on Saturday. It came yesterday, Monday, and uh, also he didn't uh, charge me shipping. He actually refunded the shipping. I think it was, uh, I think it was ten dollars shipping, and I think he ended up giving me fifteen back. So it was like sixty altogether, something like that. I don't know. So real, real nice guy. Uh, hope he gets better. You know, I don't know if he's a YouTuber, but I hope that uh, he gets his cast off and all that. But. Uh, I'm willing to work with just about anybody. It's, you know, to me, it's, you know, stuff happens, whatever. So we're going to open all these up, except for the carded ones. I'll show you those. Um, again, I never used to be a drag bus fan, but I've got that first one, so this will be my second one. I'm really digging those. I'm going to leave it in the package, but I'll show you what it looks like. So we'll get this opened, and then uh, we'll be back, and we'll put them all on that little round table. So stay tuned. Okay, we are back. So the first one we've got up here is the uh, Rolling Thunder. And these are all metal on metal, so metal chassis, metal uh, base, unlike that last set. Rubber tire with tread. Well, they all have rubber tire, but this is a race car, so it's got slicks in the back. That's a pretty, pretty sweet looking little car there. There's that one. Then we've got a bone shaker. Now this one, I'm becoming a, a fan of the bone shakers. I never used to care for them, but uh, I'm starting to like them more and more. Uh, this one is pretty sweet. The black with the uh, the chrome, the black chrome. Pretty sweet looking little car. There's that one. And then of course, the best one out of the bunch is going to be the Volkswagen T1 drag bus in blue. That's just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful car. So, as you can see, I'll probably start collecting those. All right, so we're going to get started here. First one we have, and this is going to be kind of fast, just like the other ones. I'm not going to really go over the bases. They're all metal. They're all rubber tire. So, they're all metal chassis, metal metal body. So, this is the, uh, uh, what is this, the 70 Chevelle? Yeah, 70 Chevelle SS Wagon. Not a big fan of the flames, but uh, looks nice on this car. Get our stand set up properly there. So there's that one. 
Next, we're going to have one of my favorites if it were solid color. And this would definitely be uh, one of the favorites, but it's the 64 Lincoln. That's one of my favorite cars of all time, Lincoln. But uh, I, you know, I'd like an all black, something like that. These things are really stuck in here. There's that one there. Next, we're gonna have the fished and chipped. It's got a nice little skull tampo there, and got the scallops at the top. Next, got the shoe box. It's kind of uh, questionable on that one, but I do like it the more I see it. And next, we've got the 57 Chevy. It's got some tampos on it there. Not a big fan, again, of, of the design, but it is a 57 Chevy, and I like 57 Chevy, so. This next one is probably one of my favorites also. Love the wheels. Love everything about this one. That's the El Camino there. The 71, which happens to match the number they've got on there for the racing number. Okay. Oops, there we go. Got another one of the, the gases there. Next, we've got a purple passion woodies. Again, that one would probably look better without the, the flames on the panels there. Next one is School Busted. This is pretty sweet. Really like that one actually. That's probably another one of my favorites. Okay, next we've got the GTO wagon. Another pretty nice one, especially if it didn't have the flameage on it. Okay, next we've got the custom Volkswagen Beetle. Now this one has on the top it's got a Gloss finish and on the sides it has a matte finish. Pretty sweet. Not too shabby. Now this next one is going to be another one of my favorites. I know I keep on saying that. But uh, really like this one. There's no crazy um, tampos, anything like that. You got the, the matte finish hood. It's a 68 uh, Barracuda. Next, we've got the 41 Pro Mod Willys. Next one's pretty sweet, too. The, uh, I don't know. Let's see how it stands. The stance looks a little off. Yeah, I guess it looks okay. That's the uh, 70 Chevelle FS.
Okay, the next one is a 69 Charger. Really like that one too. Actually, I'm going to pause the video in a moment here. My phone is ringing. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, 69 Charger, so we've already shown this. Move to the next one. Apologize for that little interruption. And we've got the, the Nova right there. Again, not crazy about the, the flame tampos, but it looks pretty good on this car here. I think it's a 60, yeah, it's a 66 Chevy Nova. Next, we've got the 8 crate. Then, obviously, one of my favorites, the 69 Camaro. Next one is the Ferrari, the, uh, the um, what is it, the GTO, or the, uh, yeah, 288 GTO. The next one I think they're calling the Street Rotter, I'm not sure, I believe that's what that is. But they're considered the street rotter. Could be wrong. Looking at the box here. Huh. That might be. No, that's probably the 34, actually, when I'm looking at it. I don't know. A couple of these I'm, I'm kind of unsure of. They don't list them in order, so... Anyway, this one's the Neat Streeter. Then we've got the Very 8. Which I think they had that out as a uh, Boulevard car this year, or in 2012, I believe. <coughs> Excuse me, got a little bit of a cold. Next, this nice, this next one is really, really nice. Typically, not one of my favorite cars, but I really like this one. Let's see, 57 Chrysler 300. The next one is the 34 uh, Ford Sedan. So that one they must be calling the Street Rider because I'm guessing this one here is the Golden Submarine. This next one right here. I think that's the Golden Submarine. I would imagine it looks like that. So I'm sure they're just calling that other one that the Street Rider. Actually, this car would actually be better used, uh, better, better off to take the wheels and get rid of the casting. I would love those wheels. I don't like that casting. Got the 71 Mach 1. And we've got one more. Last but not least is the 50, what is it, 51? 51 with Sabre Concept. So there are all the cars in this 30 car set. So essentially I paid $2 a car, which you figure the drag buses are probably going for about $30 themselves. 
Um, I mean, I, I could be wrong. They, you know, they, they vary in price. I'm not sure about that particular one. So, in my mind, it was a good deal. And uh, I've looked other places, and they wanted quite a bit. It looks like this guy probably got it from Walmart. It had a little sticker of like $69 on the side, so he probably got it from Walmart last year. So I think this is actually a 2011 set, or maybe a 2010. It's got 2010 on the box. I'm not sure exactly what year this is from, but uh, I should probably research that. Anyway, that's it. Hopefully you, uh, you know, if you have this set, you get to see what the cars look like out of the box. If you're thinking about buying this set, um, now you see what you get. Um, you know, it may or may, you may say, ugh, I don't want that set, or this may say, hey, I gotta get that one now. So that's kind of the goal. But anyway, if you have any questions or comments, post those below. Subscribe, and uh, I will get to my comments hopefully this evening. I was not able to reply to most of them yesterday. I don't know what the deal is, so, and I haven't been able to post comments on videos either. Uh, I did a couple, and then it stopped working, so gotta figure out what's going on there. And it's not, uh, it's not my computer. I've got a Mac, and I've tried, tried it on that, I've tried it on my PC uh, that I use for work, and then I've tried it on my iPad, and uh, I haven't tried it on the phone. But anyway, uh, we'll get to those hopefully this evening too. So again, subscribe, thanks for watching, and have a good evening.